I love my vagina. Others often laugh at it because I've only half the normal nerve endings inside my clit. Even though my ovaries hang slack, slinging around beneath my uteral stack, I love my vagina. <laughs> With its little lips puckered up, its precision aim and sense of direction, its love of being buttered up, its love of play, of making connections. Yes, I love my vagina, and my vagina loves me. It knows what I want, and I know what it needs, as with its head raised, with a friendly wink, with an eye to appraise, and its hot, swollen pink, with its puckered lips kissing, dizzy from the blood rush. My clit, my cunt, other cunts would touch. Perhaps just a handshake, or a few friendly words, or a long night spent sleepless while love is a verb till we cease to commune with a smile or a swoon. Our vagina lips smiling, having danced. <laughs> but while I love my vagina, not all vaginas love it. Some call it a cock and can't see it's a clit. Call my ovaries balls, which is ridiculous. Just cause it hangs out, cause my clit's gigantic. Just cause it dangles, cause it's prone to panic. Just cause it looks different, they call it a dick. But it's no less a vagina for being my man dick. And this isn't psychology, it's straight up biology. You see, before we were born, before we took shape, before our genitals formed and our brains rearranged, before we were torn between hormone traits, we embodied one love, and hate didn't just stay. But then, some people, they learn fear and start talking about gender dysphoria. But people, what I bring is gender euphoria! So, I love my vagina to my heart, to my core. I love my vagina. And I hope you love yours. <laughs>